Hey, what's up, YouTube? In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the top five newest tweaks that have come out in the past few days. So these tweaks are brand new to the market. I hope you guys enjoy them. So before we start, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of these top tweak videos just like this and give this video a huge thumbs up. Also, like always, a full tweaks list with repositories will be in the best tech article linked in the description of this video. All right, so let's get directly into the top tweaks. All right, so the very first one I wanted to talk about is Melior. Now, this is a new volume HUD experience by Spark Dev, and it was just released a couple days ago. But as you guys can see, that's what it looks like right there on your home screen. It's almost like peekaboo, but vertical. Again, if you guys remember, peekaboo is up in the top right hand corner like that. But as you guys can see, it really kind of messes up on iOS 11.3.1. So this is a nice alternative to that. And it looks a lot better than the stock volume HUD, which is just directly in the center of the screen. Anyway, that is Melior. That is the first tweak of today's video. So next up, we have Quotification, which is going to show us a quote of the day instead of the no recent notifications text within the notification center. All right, this one I really like. So normally on your iOS device within the widgets pane, you have this show more toggle right here. And typically I like to have them expanded. Well, with this tweak called widget extend, it automatically extends all of the widgets and hides the show more show less icon right there by default. So no more of this having to open up every single widget. It automatically expands them to their fullest automatically. Next up, this tweak called No Slow Animations 11 speeds up animations for iOS 11, just how it has on previous versions of iOS. All right, the very last one of today's video is called Fortnite Bypass. Now, this is one I'm sure a ton of users are going to enjoy. It simply lets you play Fortnite on a jailbroken device. Now, this works not only for the new iOS 11.2 to 11.4 Beta 3 Electra jailbreak, but as well as the original 11.0 to 11.1.2 jailbreak. Now, typically when you try to play Fortnite on a jailbroken device, you will receive this warning. But with the tweak called Fortnite Bypass, again, all the repositories will be in the Best Tech Info article down in the description. It will allow you to now play Fortnite on a jailbroken device. So as you guys can see, when I start my descend, instead of getting kicked back to the home screen, I am allowed to continue playing Fortnite and can play the entirety of the game on my jailbroken device and exit out and show you guys that my device is jailbroken and enter back into Fortnite. Anyway guys, that is the final fifth tweak of today's video. So as a couple bonuses, I just wanted to let you guys know that Lock Plus Pro has been fully updated to support iOS 11.3.1 as well as iOS 11.4 Beta 3. And another quick tweak that I wanted to show you guys that also has been updated for iOS 10 actually is called Power Down. So if we go to Power Down, once the volume HUD goes away, we have these sweet options right here to power off reboot or respring. As you guys can see, I'll give you a close up. So if I just click respring, we have another quick way to respring our devices in real time. Anyway, guys, that is Lock Plus Pro and Power Down. They've both recently been updated to support more iOS firmwares. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Let me know down in the comment section what your favorite tweak from today's video was. Now, I will be having a follow-up video pertaining to more jailbreak detection bypass methods, but I wanted to share with you guys this Fortnite jailbreak detection bypass today because it's just so new and it's awesome. Anyway, guys, if you are interested in that, don't forget to subscribe to the channel to be notified when that video is released. Again, don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up if you appreciate these Top Tweaks videos. Again, thanks for watching, but until next time, this is Tony signing out.